Well done, Virgo. Welcome to Horoscope-ish. This is Lindsay coming to you now. Um, <laughs> guys, guys, get you a channel and start playing. It's so much fun. All right. This is a spiritual entertainment channel and um, should not be used for legal counsel or advice or life-changing advice for that matter. And, uh, you know, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. If anything, have fun. Don't try and make it your story. I'm using a familiar set. Familiar. I'm going to do a Celtic cross. What is that for Virgo? Ooh. Oh, what does Anton Ego say? He's like, tell your chef. <laughs> He's looking for some fresh, a new perspective. Some fresh perspective. Fresh perspective. It doesn't look too fresh, but when you think about it, <laughs> you know, um, mm, maybe different. Oh. What's the challenge of this fresh perspective? What is it, tell me? I gotta know. I like to know. I need to know. Um. <clears throat> The fresh perspective and the challenge now because of that fresh perspective is, please don't leave me out, please. <laughs> I've been listening to Natasha Bedingfield. The rest is still unwritten. Please don't leave me out. Oh, why are you flailing, Virgo? Don't worry about it. Oh, man, I'm an ascendant, Virgo. I get it. <laughs> like, like when you're, no, I'm going to get left out. You're like looking into the future. You're like looking in, like, like looking into what you can do and how you can, I, won't, I almost want to, I don't know, I don't know, as, mm, when I, when I, when I look into, um, the magician, you know, or tarot in general, like, manipulation is literally like, you're like, how can I manipulate this to, 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 you know, so I can hold it better, like, okay, this, I'm gonna manipulate this box, I'm already doing it, because I need it closed, done, okay. <laughs> The way we talk about it is psychological manipulation. We're not talking about that. We're talking about uh, the Five of Cups being sad because you got a different perspective and now you're being left out. You feel left out. Being left out is an illusion. <laughs> I had to come to that conclusion in an illusion of seclusion. <laughs> and then, you know, oh, come on. All right. <clears throat> you know, I ain't even sorry about my squeaky ass chair. Okay. Uh, I'm from the country, you know, like it that way. Mm. You all heard that song. Take me through the country. Okay. All right. In the past, you're keeping your head down. This is recently. You're just keeping your head down and working. <laughs> so not like Virgo. Workaholism. I used to do that. I used to be like, yes, I love my job. Just don't love <laughs> using it as a way to escape something else daily. Um, just burying yourself in your work so you don't have to see a damn thing. Uh, uh, five of swords is what's on your mind. All right, what this? What? Why? Why do we have this here? What is this? Did? Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. So something was done that was done to put some some something was done in spite of something else. Meaning something was done intentionally to hurt some other situation. Okay. So. Seven of Pentacles. Let me read it. Is that for real? Okay. Um, I looked at you like you were the one to ask. Uh, oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. So, Virgo, you may have mm, done or said something that... I know, we all, we, we all... We all... Listen, people say dumb things when they're upset or scared, so... Oh... Uh, 
There's a slew, there's a spectrum, there's all this stuff surrounding it. Whatever they're like, oh, you did that to be spiteful. Okay, well, you know, stay away from people who are spiteful unless, you know, they change. You know, and with a sincere apology comes a sincere change, you know. So, you've got the Seven of Pentacles in the future here, which means you're just, you're just, you can't do much more to grow much more. Um... There, you can't really, you know, uh, you can't manifest much more. Um, you're, you're at your level. Um, but that doesn't have to happen. Why are you taking for go, Virgo? No goals right there in your heart? Oh, now you know. What do I know? <laughs> um, mm. So, people see you as very happy. What are you so happy about? Ugh. One time I heard something that I should not have shared, but I was like, you know, that I think I was trying to uplift someone and it was not helpful. Oh my gosh, it was not helpful at all. And I knew the context too. I knew the context. It was just, you know, when you just have great intentions and then you don't slide in the logic that goes along with whatever you're trying to do. And it just doesn't turn out. It turns out worse instead of better, but I was like, you know, sometimes when something is the reason for your, like, total happiness, it can be taken away from you. And why would I say that? Well, I was, oh, I was so naive and just trying to help, but let me tell you something. Sometimes you just gotta let people sit with their thoughts and not try and make them feel better. Um, I, ugh, I'm just having responses. Virgo, this is you probably, too, uh, giving people, uh unsolicited advice that you know sometimes you just gotta let go and let God you know <laughs> you, you gotta let let like God is our biggest teacher correct and I believe that God is within all of us so yes in that aspect it was helpful no in that aspect that at that person's level meaning their belief systems and their uh, already I don't want that from you Lindsay and I'm like I already know that about this person, and I offered something I shouldn't have, and... Uh. <sighs> Alright. Anywho. I guess it was too recent for me to, like, you know, we all make mistakes. But, that was not helpful information. You know, um... I wish I could tell you more about it, Virgo, but, I mean, it would, it just, it just... When you know people... And you keep seven, it's almost like insanity. I, I went insane temporarily. I knew an outcome of something. I knew that something wouldn't be able to be lifted from a situation and I still offered words and uh, I knew better. I knew better and somehow, um, yeah, you're there. Thank you for letting me harp. Um, four of swords in reverse. Oh, you're just full throttle. You're full throttle. like. We got, we got, like, maybe, uh, maybe springtime is significant, right? Springtime, you're, yeah, you're busy, busy, busy. You're not, you don't have time to rest, and you're happy. You're happy just being <laughs> little bunny. That's amazing. I mean, I'd be following a bunny, too. Um, well, I just see this being you, the bunny. <laughs> and you're, you're at ease right there. That is, that is, that is a big bunny, too. What's the jackrabbit a symbol for? That's a jackrabbit, right? Got my computer door next to me so I can look some fun stuff up. Jackrabbit. Woo! Um, no, not, not that. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I don't know why I didn't think that would pop up! Um, oh, Google, you really... I need to go filter through this. I might have a child on this computer one day. That'd be terrible. Um... Spiritual meeting. Thank you guys for chilling out with me for a second while I do this. Skidoosh. Yeah, you're fertile. You're 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 spontaneous. You got so much. You got so much energy. You don't you don't have time to rest. And the rabbits are just known for that. Okay, I like the visionary. You're you're planning your future with your imagination. Ooh, look at you go, Virgo. You in your head. Okay. Seven of Wands, what you don't see coming. Ooh. Alright, so you might have to get a, ugh, a bit defensive. 
or defense is headed girl defense is headed your way Ugh, my lord <laughs> they're so thin that i don't know there's multiples cuatro tarjetas oh my goodness okay so we got ten of pentacles legacy like family accumulation uh, seven of cups confusion over an accumulation between an emperor that's moving on and they're defensive they're defensive you're defensive so Virgo you're gonna have the high ground with this too someone's moving on and they have so many choices this is emperor energy there could be an Aries in your life or you could have Aries in your chart. Um, look up, look up stuff in your chart if you don't know your chart, because um, this is this is a significant life change. Like you're going to be moving on. You don't see it coming, and you do have the high ground. Oh yes, you do. Like your what you've created is. It's a seven. <laughs> it's a seven. It's mystical. It can't really be replicated unless uh, someone understands how to become you, you know? Um, but yeah, somebody's going to get kind of defensive about... You're going to get defensive over... There is defense over somebody moving on with plenty of options who is, go who is accumulating their Ten of Pentacles and they are... They're kind of cold um, about... They're, they're cold and they're moving on, but like an emperor doesn't, doesn't take responsibility for other people's feelings, um, necessarily not taking responsibility for other people's feelings, but they're practical. So this is either you being practical or somebody else being practical. You don't see it coming, but someone's like, yeah, I'm, I'm moving on. You've made this confusing. Someone's saying to someone else, you've made this so confusing. I'm moving on. And, um, that's that's actually spirit led that's a uh, soul led someone's being called is it you virgo all right <clears throat> i think you are being called i don't know it kind of feels like that especially with all this man that's spite and being worried about the spite um doing something to hurt someone hmm? but someone's like i'm moving on because this is this is confusing Ooh, your divine guidance is to go back to your roots Remember how you remember how you used to be, Virgo? Go back to that. Go back to childhood. What were you like? You were resilient. You liked to party. You liked to play. You like to celebrate, be, be around people, you know, those cups or emotions like you loved, 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 loved being charming. I mean, I don't know, this is kind of like, okay, so you're resilient, right? That's how you were when you were little. You were really resilient, and um, you just, you could face anything. Um, face anything. And you had enough love to go around. <laughs> to everybody. <laughs> everybody wants it now. Everybody stands in line. I don't see what it would be. I mean, honestly. I love the seriousness slash rando playful with Virgo. It pairs well with Gemini, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I realized my ascendant and put, like, everything kind of just, I'm like, oh damn. <laughs> Your chart will tell you who you are. It's fascinating. Um, and then the end result, stop. Even though the picture isn't wildly elaborate, um, it's six of wands. That's a public recognition. That's, that's a, uh, you're going to get a lot of attention over this. It's good attention. You're going to like it. Um, but you may be, okay, and I just got the original, I just had a little clairvoyant moment there of uh, having the uh, six of wands from the Lenore, oh, Rider Waite. And the original Rider Waite deck has um, this person, you know, like, being being almost paraded. And they've got like a crown and a staff and it's got the wreath on it, like victory and what you've created. Like that's total public recognition for what you've created. Oh my gosh, my Cancerian energy just went off. 
like the opposite of like anxiety but butterflies like <laughs> okay it's more exciting if anything uh, I wouldn't worry about the past um, I mean if, if, if you you can be thoughtful about it but just we say this in my house Enola homes it. Take the emotion out of it because technically feelings and emotions, emotions are there so that you can remember the feeling that you had so that you can't do the same thing twice that hurt twice. Um, that's what emotions are there for. Like, hey, uh, this is a familiar emotion. Like, why am I feeling this way? Look at the feeling. Look at the feeling. Feel the emotion. The, take the emotion out of it and make a logical move. You know, make an if you're gonna analyze, if you're gonna overanalyze anything, Virgo, make it be the logical thing. Make logical, <laughs> make it make sense. <laughs> but you can't, and you will, and this is this is proof. It's proof. Uh, you still gonna come out with a wreath. Wreaths are pretty. Okay, peace out, Virgo. I love you. Bye.